It's the start of summer for us in the Northern Hemisphere, so what better way to celebrate than exploiting some awesome life hacks to make the summer sun even sweeter. Here are 10 summer life hacks you should definitely try this summer. Amazing! Summer is the time for going outdoors, doing exercise and things like hiking, which means you'll have to keep hydrated. Carrying enough water is often tough, especially if bag space is limited, which is why you should make an easy paracord water jug harness. For this to work properly, it's best to braid a thick cord yourself with two shoelaces, approximately 80 inches long. Beginning with the carabiner of your choice, begin tying your cord with a girth hitch and then end it with an overhand like shown here. Start braiding using what's called a four strand round braid. Here you can see number four goes under number three and number two, then over number two, becoming number three. Repeat this pattern to make around four or five inches of rope. After you've braided enough, attach the harness to the water bottle's neck with a simple overhand knot. Wrap the cord tightly around it several times until it reaches back to the braided cord. The knot should fit snugly around the bottle's neck. Then complete another overhand knot at the base. Now finish off the braiding down the bottle before you reach halfway down the bottle. Tie it off with some overhand knots and finally cut and melt the ends. This harness can easily be attached to the outside of any bag that you take on your summer adventures. Easily avoid that melting mess at the bottom of your waffle cone with this easy life hack. All you have to do is grab a marshmallow and stuff it into the bottom to plug it. For more ice cream real estate, just cut the marshmallow in half and then place it at the bottom. You could also add a drizzle of sauce to sweeten the surprise at the end of your cone. Now that you've got a means of carrying your water bottle, you'll want to keep it as cool as possible. And here's a simple hack so that you aren't forced to carry around a frozen bottle which refuses to melt. Fill an empty water bottle about a third full and place it in the freezer on its side. Once it's frozen, fill the rest of the bottle with water for a longer lasting cold bottle, which will be drinkable instead of rock solid when you need a drink. Just remember that reusing plastic bottles without washing them may harbour bacteria, but that they emit carcinogens into the fluid is a myth debunked by the American Cancer Society. If you prefer something a little more impressive, then try this instant freeze trick. Just place purified water into your freezer for about three hours and carefully remove it. Be extra careful not to shake the bottle when you take it out of the freezer and then once you're ready, either hit it or smack it against the table. Another impressive way to unleash the freeze is to pour it on ice cubes slowly to create a slushy treat. You can add food coloring or try it with other drinks like Coca-Cola to make it look even cooler. If you get carried away, you could also try this cool trick. Just throw a piece of ice into a wine glass with the water and watch it crystallize. Instead of storing your ice pops on their side, which creates air pockets and uneven grooves from the freezer, try storing them upright in the freezer. You can utilize every inch of freezer space by clipping the ice pops underneath the shelves for a guaranteed clean cut every time. This is a simple yet brilliant way to cut and serve watermelon. Start by cutting your watermelon in half so that you have two equal pieces. Place one half face down onto your cutting board and carefully cut away the watermelon's rind from top to bottom, making sure to keep as much red flesh as possible. Trim off any remaining rind and slice off the top. Slice the watermelon into lines about an inch wide and rotate the watermelon sideways to cut perpendicular to the slices you just made. Find a bowl that fits over the top of your watermelon and place it over the top. Now clean up any excess juice with a paper towel and then hold the board securely to flip it all right side up. Finally, insert some popsicle sticks into the perfectly sliced watermelon rectangles and enjoy your mess-free watermelon treat. Grab some large and small plastic cups. Get a barbecue skewer and carefully push it through the top of the big cups to get started. Then remove the skewer and drive it through the smaller cup so that you can place it through both the smaller and larger cups like this. Get creative and add some food coloring to the bottom of each cup. Now fill the entire thing with water so that each cup rises to an equal level. After centering the small cups, place it in the freezer for a few hours. Once you're finished, remove the skewer and use your warm hands to remove the cup. These cups are great for drinking out of with your friends. You could even go one step further and create some fruity ice cubes. Just slice up some berries and lemons and add them to the ice cube tray with whatever flavoring you desire. Fill it up with water and freeze them. Add them to your ice cup refreshment and enjoy. 
If you need a drink cooler and keep the packaging materials around from your online orders, then you can easily make a cheap cooler. Grab a cardboard box and measure out its dimensions. Cut out some bubble wrap that matches the dimensions of each side as closely as possible and then wrap them up in aluminium foil. Once it's all wrapped up, just slide them all into the box, add some beverages and dump in some ice. A styrofoam cooler of this size costs around $20, whereas this one easily costs less than $1. That's an insane saving for less than 10 minutes of crafting. It may be old fashioned, but sitting a bowl of ice in front of a rotating fan is effective if you don't have air conditioning. All you have to do is fill a tray with ice, pour in some water if you enjoy an occasional drizzle of liquid, just like you're in the spa, sit it in front of a fan and enjoy. It can spot cool any human or area of the house with a refreshing wind chill effect. Here's an even simpler way to make some slushy refreshments. Grab some juice packs of your favorite flavor and stick them in the fridge for several hours or overnight. Cut the tops open and enjoy. If you don't have any juice packs, then try this. In a saucepan, add two cups of sugar and one cup of water. Bring it to a boil and stir until the sugar is dissolved. Remove the pan from the heat and allow it to cool. Now transfer that batch to some containers and add a packet of unsweetened flavored drink mix. Now throw some ice into your blender and grind it all up into a nice slushy consistency. Transfer it over to some cups or bowls with a ladle and then squeeze your ready-made syrup right on top. If you're feeling overheated, you should definitely try this final hack. It's the simplest one. All you need to do is fill a spray bottle with water and then add around 10 to 20 drops of peppermint essential oil and shake well. Whenever you need to cool down, just spray yourself with it. Peppermint oil will give off a chilling effect to make you feel more comfortable out in the sun. There you have it. Let me know how you get along with these in the comment section down below. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe and click that bell icon to never miss another video. Thanks for watching.